I used to be partying all night. Staying up all night. Either like I work third shift or I just be up. But now, <laughs> my bedtime is now. <laughs> like not now, but right now. Did I even introduce this video? If I haven't, I'm Demonte and this is the Preppy Savages Podcast. I am finally on my last video. Well, it's the last video I'm going to shoot today. I might continue with the College Finesse series, but this video is titled Major Monday. You can check it out on my website, PreppySavages.com. But, so that's why I'm reading from the laptop because I already did the blog. So, uh, sometimes I take notes and stuff for my videos. But, I already had the script written. So, why? Why would I do that? So, let's let's get into it. Okay, so picking a major. Yes, it can be challenging, but I wouldn't contemplate on picking a major for too long. If you attend a university, I say within the first two years. Even if you want to get done within a four-year period, if you wait until the second year, then hopefully most of your credits are counted for the new major. Or if you wait after the second year and you already picked a major and you want to change your major. My advice, pick something you are passionate about Take into consideration your interests and follow your heart. Example, because you know I love giving examples. A teacher may expect to, uh, if you want to be a teacher, if you major in like education, something of that nature, then you already expect that it the pay is low. But if you are passionate about it, then you wouldn't mind teaching kids and going forward with the major. Focus on how you are going to sustain yourself. So now, my personal story. After I take a bite of this delicious cheesecake. So my first week of school, I was a journalism major. <laughs> that changed real quick. I switched to media, been out of school for two years. Uh, the reason why I didn't stay with journalism because it was honestly, I'm going to be straight up, it was boring. I mean, it wasn't, I mean, it was boring to me. It could have been interesting to somebody else. But if there was a lot of history classes that I had to take, ethnic classes, and blah, blah, blah. And <laughs> I'm like, mm, I kind of wanted a, a major that teach me how to tell stories creatively. So I found my major, Media Production and Studies. They actually changed the name of my major, but it, that, that's what that's the uh, I just tell people I majored in media, but that's the name of it, the full name, Media Production and Studies. And then at my school, we all have to have a minor, and I had something related to that, film, in theater was my minor. It was our the departments were combined, so that's why it's film in theater. If I had to go back, will I choose my major and minor again? Mm. <laughs> Slightly. But if I if I didn't choose my what I studied, then I definitely would have did the individualized study plan. And if you don't know what you want to study, check into the individualized study plan. Now, depending on the type of career you want to go into, it may come back and bite you. But not bite you hard, not like a rock roll that bite you or, a ch you know, chihuahuas are powerful, but like a little dog that may not bite hard. <laughs> but some some problems that people have with an individualized study plan is that depending on what field you want to go to, maybe your future employers say it's not specific enough, but that's if you're like, 
you know, say if you're going to be like a chemistry engineer, don't try to do an individualized study plan, like with, you know, engineering classes and your know, future chemistry engineer employer wants you to be that specific and not, you know, come with a mechanical background or a industrial engineering background or whatever other engineering major. But I did not know, I didn't, I guess, pay attention to like my junior year of other classes my university offer, like photography and uh, visual communication technology courses, just different things like that. So if I didn't pick what I choose to study, I would definitely would have picked the individualized study plan. And then, and then the, those, it's rules to that, but at least you get more freedom. My major was vague enough. But that individualized study plan is vague. And then also, yeah, so I wanted to say something about my major, mon major or minor, but I guess that will be another video. Go to my contact section. Let me know if there's any other college topics you want me to talk about, any other things you want me to do during the podcast, feel free to hit me up. Thanks for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed the series. Go check out the other videos of the College Finesse series. Thanks for watching the Preppy Savages podcast. I'm out. I'm about to go to sleep. That's what I'm about to do.